Hey everybody, I'm Jacob Tormina, writer and director of Easy Out, and you're on Speak Easy. You should take a pillow out. No, I, I think it adds some character. <laughs> some flavor to the uh, interview. Okay, let me think of a question to ask you first. I'm here with Luke Tuzian, the editor and colorist for the film. How are you doing today, Luke? <clears throat> Good. That's great. What drew you to the project Easy Out? The screenplay! And actually, originally there was a dog in it. I want to make a movie with a dog in it, but then you guys cut the dog and replaced it with a fish. <laughs> That's true, that happened. I think Easy Out is like Oscar worthy, to be clear. Which Oscar do you think you would win? Um, best everything. I guess the best thing about collaborating with Jacob, uh, it was it was so easy because he's such he's such a good collaborator. Um, and when there was like turn the, turn the spinal face towards the when there was a when there was a problem, we would both put our heads together and uh, come to an artistic conclusion, and the end result was just fantastic. And I think that's a, actually a very hard thing to find in student films is uh, collaboration. This movie's just it's, miserable from start to finish. That's see that's sort of true, but. <laughs> But we still laugh at it. But right? it's funny, yeah. It, uh, it, with test screenings, it's been fantastic, so I think that was... That's true, we have screened it in front of a few audiences now, yeah. and uh, when we have a lot of people, uh, people are cracking up in they their are. seats. Yeah. And then, on the sad part, people are not cracking up in their seats. Which is good, to be careful if it's the opposite. Exactly. Because so because there's $700 left to raise, I figured I would cut my hair to a seven. But actually, I'm not going to do it. I would prefer if you would cut it. You? Yep, we're not doing it in my apartment, though. <laughs> well, I'll clean it up for you. You're not doing it in my apartment. You're doing it on the roof, outside. It's not happening in the apartment. Okay, we'll do it on the roof. So, do you think that that, that people will think that's interesting? Hey, I'm gonna shave my head. People might draw attention more to I the think, Kickstarter. I think it'll work if you promise that if you raise the full amount, which is what, 1300? Yeah. That you'll shave with a huge straight razor. Yeah, no, so for like, real. Straight bald. I am completely okay with that. Welcome back! Um, so, Luke, how was the experience? Honestly, it was a lot of fun. We went to the roof and uh, shaved my head down to a seven. Luke bent the rules a little bit. <laughs> I don't know if you've seen it, but... <laughs> Let me know what you guys think uh, about the haircut idea, um, because I was planning on maybe not going with it if nobody responded to it. <laughs> But now I guess, you know, now I guess I don't have a choice. So next time, when we have 600, maybe 500 left, we're going to be interviewing Charlotte from the film, and uh, she's going to shave my head a little bit shorter. Hopefully it'll look better than this. Let's see. <laughs> next time on Speak Easy. Um, so that's it for tonight. Luke? Yeah, so a lot of people worked really hard on this film, and we all had a lot of fun, and we'd really love to see it go to the next level. So we really, really appreciate any help you could give. Even if you can't donate money, just share our campaign. Share it to anyone you know that would be interested in helping uh, young filmmakers. I really, really appreciate it, and thank you. Thank you very much. Ready? Or, or, One, two, three. Luke and Jacob in the morning. That was beautiful. Copyright. <laughs>